TGA is a powerful tool for the analysis of the decomposition of a material. And when you add an evolved gas analyzer, such as a mass spectrometer, you introduce a second dimension of chemical analysis to your experiment. In this TA Tech Tip, we will discuss programming and setting up of the TGA mass spec experiment using the Discovery TGA and the Discovery mass spectrometer. Then we'll show how to import and analyze your data using TRIOS data analysis software. The first key to an effective TGA mass spec experiment is programming the mass spectrometer method. The Discovery mass spec offers two experimental modes, bar chart and peak jump. In bar chart mode, the instrument continuously scans a programmed mass range. This mode is used for fingerprinting experiments when you are not sure of the decomposition products to expect. The user simply defines a mass range and the sensitivity level, which will dictate the scanning speed. In peak jump mode, the user can select discrete mass signals to monitor. This is more useful when you know which off-gas products to detect and provides for higher sensitivity and resolution. Once the mass spectrometer is programmed and initiated, we then program our TGA experiment. The first step in our thermal method is to hold isothermal at ambient to allow background gases to reach steady state. We then activate the mass spec data collection with the external event segment and ramp as typical in a TGA method. At the end of the method, we include a second external event segment to terminate mass spec data collection. When the experiment is complete, TRIO software is used to open both the TGA and the mass spec data files and combine them into a single data file. We can then prepare plots which include both the TGA signal and any selected masses from the mass spec data file. This allows us to present the data in a concise plot. Individual masses can be added or removed from the plot as desired. In this TA Tech Tip, we discussed how to set up and program a TGA mass spec experiment and how to import and analyze the resulting data using TRIOS. In our next installment, we will go more in depth into how to optimize the conditions and ensure the highest quality of data.